Hey, I'm James. I'm about six foot. I live in Butte. I'm auditioning for Andy. And thank you for your consideration. Who's the hunk? But you can never be too sure. Robots are pretty tricky. It's clear you all can talk. But if you would just listen for a minute, maybe I can explain. I could listen to him talk all day. I'll be gone tomorrow. I just need to stay here for a night. And I promise you, I am not a robot. <laughs> I'm totally a robot. <laughs> yep, gonna kill everyone here. The accents for the ladies. This is for whoever's using the internet here. The motherboard sent me here to kill him, or kill them. And everyone else, really, kind of what I do, kill a robot and all. Just need to make sure everyone is here before I start blasting. Can't have anyone escape. So how about you prove you're not a robot? Sure, little girl. How? Are uh, you hungry? John, it's the end of the world. We don't have time for your cooking show. Excuse me? A what? I have my own cooking show. Everyone. And I mean everyone to my kitchen for my show. Elaine, don't forget Gam Gam and Peepaw. Well. It's all about portion, folks. And butter. I mean, flavor. What? I'll destroy humanity in a minute. That portion is mine. Dig in. Just make sure you save room for dessert. You know, after the first two courses, I think John might be worth keeping around. Maybe I don't have to kill everyone. Nah, I definitely do. I'll kill everyone else after dessert. Keep John as a culinary slave. The only thing better than a caramel coffee bun a salted caramel coffee bun. Save some for me, guys. I'm hungry, too. Just like that, I remember why I hate humans. It's time. Just need to let him finish making it. Don't want to get in the way of his process. Oh my god. That is on point. What's that spice? I like it. It's just almost too much. Spice? I didn't add any spice. I taste something spicy. But, like I said, it's good. It's just sugar, flour, butter, a few other things. Maybe it's the cinnamon. Oh, and salt at the end, of course. Your salt, actually. My salt? Yeah, well, a wise young lady once asked, told me to ask for forgiveness, not permission. I figured it'd be pretty easy to get your forgiveness for grabbing it out of your jacket after you tasted what it did to my buns. It's beautiful, John. I love it. Thank you. <laughs>